today on the web. Spain's monarchy comes under fire from web users. The latest fashions in web advertising. And the day's pick of the best. The King of Spain is facing a volley of criticism. The debate over his legitimacy is once more aflame on the net following the violent protests in Catalonia. A Chilean blogger criticizes the Catalan separatists who burnt pictures of the sovereign. But these images relayed over the web, in his opinion, illustrate the need to reflect upon the monarchy's place in society. But criticism is rife. This blogger's criticism is particularly aggressive. He claims that Juan Carlos doesn't even deserve to be called a Spanish citizen since he was put in place by Franco, a dictator. The cost of the royal family is also frequently criticized, like on this blog or in this much-viewed online video which caricatures a Juan Carlos sponging off the Spanish people. But as is proved by the success of this site, the king is still one of the most loved national figures in Spain. It lets you retrace the history of the Bourbons in images. The internet advertising market is booming. In France, the market doubled last year. Microsoft has just announced that it hopes to make 25% of its profits using online marketing. Beyond the success of the classic e-ad, i.e. banners and pop-ups, the latest fashion is for interactive commercials. Initially, these allowed you to give orders to the commercial's actors, like this waitress who's singing the praises of a brand of beer. But today, these commercials are riding on the back of the success of YouTube by inviting web users to make their own video commercials, which are subsequently posted on a site which has been specially created for the purpose. Another fashion, miniseries, like this one from a major French sportwear brand starring the Rugby World Cup idol Frédéric Michelac. <laughs> If you still haven't heard of William Sled, where have you been? He's the latest rising star in the fashion world on the web. His show called Ask a Gay Man is a phenomenal success on the net and has already been viewed more than a million times. The cherry on the cake for the young 23-year-old? NBC right. wants to pick up his you show. Know girl scenes, though. They're for Stephanie. <laughs> The longest collective web art fresco is in construction. As of now, you can add your contribution to this mammoth undertaking by posting your work on the site visualsoftheworld.com. The project has been conceived by Dutch web designers and the fresco is already 280 meters long and the contributors are from all around the world.